And the second problem is given an equation and obviously V here is volume because given cubic feet and T is time in terms of hour then part A find the unit in this group and this group to solve the problem like this we have to make sure the unit is consistent on the left of the equation and right of the equation and the left of the equation is given unit is cubic feet therefore you can find out the unit for 2.79 times 10 to negative 2 had to be cubic feet because we know whenever you see natural base natural log and log those are dimensionless group they don't have unit so you can go ahead to ignore the units for now in that part therefore you get the unit for 2.79 times 10 to negative 2 is cubic feet then we can look at the part with natural base natural base has the power 2t squared and given t is hours and we know that the exponent is dimensionless group as well but t has unit which is in terms of hour therefore we have to make sure that the unit cancel out so that you can have a dimensionless group in the power therefore we can leave it blank for now and t is hour hour square in order to cancel out the hour square we have to have our negative 2 in this way our negative 2 plus 2 is equal to 0 then you get a constant therefore the unit for 2 is our negative 2 part B in part A we find out the unit for this group and this group then you can convert that to the unit in the second problem then you go ahead and write down what is known this is cubic feet then we have to convert that to cubic meter to do that we can find out cubic feet let's go ahead and write down this way we know that 1 meter is 3.2808 which is given from the book put the exponent outside then you can cancel out the cubic feet then you have cubic meter let's look at the first part first then you will get 7.90 keeping 3 specific times 10 to the negative 4 cubic meter now let's look at the part with exponent because from part A we know that if you use number 2 it means the unit is hour to negative 2 but it's asking for t prime in terms of time in terms of second then which means that we have to convert that to second for hour in the denominator second denominator so you can cancel out the hour because the exponent for the hour is negative 2 then you have negative 2 right here in this way can cancel out the hour to, sec to negative 2 and second to negative 2 and t is in second this would be t prime then cancel out the unit then you will have a dimensionless group in the exponent in this way we can convert that to second and we know that one hour is 3600 second therefore 
just for the power part, we have 1.54 times 10 to the negative 7 t prime square. Then you can go ahead and write a new equation. V prime is this is the first part and this is the second part. 7.90 times 10 to the negative fourth. This is cubic meter natural base 1.54 times 10 to the negative 7 t prime square. This is a new equation. Please know that in some book, they like to use EXP to stand for the natural base, which means E.